Today we have the great Dr. John Southall with us. Dr. Southall, how are you doing? I'm doing well, thank you. And thank you for inviting me to this wonderful session. Tell me a little bit about your experience at Midwest and how you got involved in Midwest Clinic. Okay, this is the strangest story you're ever going to hear, Stan. I actually, in high school, my sophomore year, my band director, Mr. George Page, told us about the Midwest Conference, and um, he, he encouraged us to um, try to attend. In my sophomore year, I was on the school newspaper. Again, this is an inner city high school, 99.9% .9 one ethnicity, um, and I went down with a friend, L train, bus, another bus, and I walked into the Midwest registration and I had my little ID that said I was a high school news reporter and I went nervously up to the registration and I didn't, I didn't know A from Z and they were so kind to me in the registration area. This kid is here and he wants to report and be a part of it. And they gave me my sophomore, junior and senior years. I got pass access. And there I was at the Midwest Conference where we were at the Hilton in the grand ballroom. And I was there on the front row on the end watching the bands perform an orchestra live. And if you will remember at the time, it was when the actual there was a guy who sat at a projector screen and he turned the pages of the score. Humorous note, several times that individual got lost and I, I was so <laughs> overjoyed that I, read, that I read music well enough to understand, wait, he didn't get that DSL coda. Anyway, but that was my experience. And I have to tell you, I'm proud to say that this December, will be my 42nd year of attending the Midwest Conference. I have been inspired by all of the activities. I have been inspired by the, the, the selected performances, uh, the, the ensembles, but the biggest part about the Midwest Conference for me is that it's home, Stan. It's home, it's La Familia, my family my home and when and it's a shame i told richard crane uh midwest president several times that when i go to midwest i walked into the mccormick place and i think ah this is my home i am here i am loved i am appreciated i am valued and that's what midwest brings to me